Previously on... Ronan, what is best in life? He said all you have to do is get some good grass and roll it every day for 600 years. Now, back to the present. Get you out of there. Well then. You can't get rid of me forever. <laughs> I will come I, back. I couldn't get rid of you like then. It was not working or cooperating. Foreshadowing. Oh, right. I forgot to. <laughs> that would help. I was like, Good. why is there no music or sound or anything? All right. Ah! There we go. You've got to make your own kind of music. Make the music. That's you. Make you. I believe we were. Outside the um, police. Yeah, this place. Cemetery. Yay, we're here. Oh sweet. Oh god, glitches already. <laughs> no, oh, why? Oh fuck. Oh, I want to do that again. Uh, there we go. All right. What is going on with the ground here? Oh my god. Oh, okay. We're so. We're already like less than two minutes in. And we found two glitches. That's great. Oh, yeah. That that's even better. <laughs> Stop dancing around like an idiot, man. <laughs> All right, I need to teleport, don't I? How did I do that? <laughs> uh, I don't remember buttons. <laughs> no. What happens when we stop ghosting for like oh, there three we weeks? Go. I can't do it in first-person view for some reason. Got you. Oh god, oh god, oh no, get away from me. Get you and then I gotta hide. Alright. Got this. Distracted and grow. What else am I fucking paying you for? <laughs> We're not paying him, that's the point. Um could be. Good money. Uh Ectoplasm. <laughs> <laughs> well, he. Uh, no. I mean, he's no. a ghost crow, so, like, maybe he eats ectoplasm. I don't think that's how it works. Um. Well. Like, ectoplasm crumbs? Exactly. Like. Yum. Or, like, little ghost bugs. <laughs> Every time somebody steps on a caterpillar, he just, like, appears in the ghost world. And that's what they subsist on. That's a sucky life for a caterpillar. You step up, like someone steps on you with their big ugly foot and then a bird eats yeah, your soul. Probably should have brought our one <laughs> I mean, so... like, that's already kind of their life to begin with, though, so. <laughs> they get stepped on, they get eaten. <laughs> Sometimes so. they turn into butterflies. And then they die. Sometimes they're lucky enough. But yeah, oh, why? <laughs> why? You weren't lucky enough. Alright, run here. this way. I'm not sure where I'm supposed to go, but we'll find it. Where are you? Oh yeah, these things. I need eight more of those. That's good to know. What are you? You're just a lamp. A lantern, if you may. Shadow guy. It just disappeared. That was cool. You know, I'm pretty sure there are ghosts of witches right around this spot. Don't worry, little boy. I'll protect you. Okay. That Jaeger works for me. <laughs> or knock off Jaeger. What does it say? It is stop wiggling it around, bro. That's an interesting brand. Yeah, that is like the best <laughs> brand. <laughs> it is Burgermeister. Burgermeister. <laughs> I kinda want a burger now. Oh man, me too. Let's teleport to five guys. Yeah, that'd be awesome. Um. Yeah, I could go for like Wendy's even. Wendy's has some banging burgers, especially that like brioche, whatever, uh, like triple cheese gouda bacon whatever thing that they what? have. <laughs> what? <laughs> I haven't been to like this fast so food place in a while. It's like this like Gouda bacon burger, but it's like 
so cheesy and it's on like a brioche bun. It's delicious. It's very good. It's very good. <laughs> very, very good. I, I just, I just want meat, man. I haven't eaten meat yet all day. Uh, I hate being Christian. I can't uh, eat meat on Fridays. It sucks. Yeah, I remember when I used to do that. Yeah. <clears throat> I've got an old person living in this house that will nag me consistently if I don't observe the rule, so you know. I mean... I think I'm supposed to go over this way, but there's nothing <laughs> over there. <laughs> Hi, Crow. What are you doing? I... Is there someone we're supposed to be looking for? Oh. That ah, <laughs> went the wrong way. I found it. That. Uh, yeah, that, that never happened. <laughs> Don't know what you're talking about. Not at all. I could go for some Taco Bell, too. <laughs> oh. It's been so long for that Taco Bell. Apparently they have... <clears throat> I just watched this video um, where somebody like pre-ordered a taco. And, what? Like, it's a new taco that they have out, apparently. And they were doing this promotion. It's like, pre-order a taco! It's a surprise! You don't know what the heck you're getting. So you just say, like, I want a taco, and then, like, a random taco, and then you'll eat it? Pretty much, you gotta go like pick it up and shit. Um, all right, I'll get back to that story in a second. Okay. Uh, I told Rex about what Ronan the Barbarian told me about the criminal past. He looked concerned, but not for my safety. He just knows how tough it is to put a life together after building a rap sheet. I don't know why she sounds like a freaking twenty pack a day smoker, <laughs> but she's manly apparently now. <laughs> Even if you're completely reformed, people don't give you a chance. Hearing this gave me a new sympathy for Ronan the Barbarian. He's working so hard to make a life for himself. I will have to think about this carefully. Yeah, so, Taco Bell. <laughs> um... <laughs> Good job. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, it was like this promotion. I don't know if it's still going on or not, but like... You pre-order a mystery item, and then you go and pick it up on a certain day between 2 and 4 or something like that but you need to like bring like your receipt so that they'll be like oh yes the uh, the history er, the history the mystery thing that's so weird and I think it was like some sort of new chalupa or something okay this is shaking but it won't let me Get rid of it like it does most things that shake like that. It's just cold. You gotta chill, man. I mean, there is a lot of ghostly coldness coming off of these yeah. stones and stuff. Seriously, you demand too much. I'm just saying, bro. <laughs> like, every other gate that's shaked like that. Shaken? Shaked? <laughs> uh, wiggled. Look, didn't. <laughs> wiggled. <laughs> Danced. Stop. <laughs> I'm on your side. I'm trying to figure out who killed you. No, she. I don't think she can talk, bro. Policeman yeah, killed yeah. him. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm a cop. I don't think that's what she means, man. Yeah, no. I am a tree. <laughs> I knew it. Oh my God, you. You're not trying to escape me. You want me to see something? She really likes trees. Ah, <laughs> uh, especially ones with ropes on them. Find out what she's pointing at. Okay. Uh, okay, what what sound did that sound like? A branch breaking? A crack in the thingy? Or a rope? Um, all I heard is my dogs barking. <laughs> <laughs> so... Okay, that's helpful. I'm that gonna go with a branch, maybe. Go for it. Why not? Something heavy. Rope. I mean, it sounded like a branch, but it sounded kind of deep. That seemed more violent. Great. I fucked it up. Mm -hmm. Awesome. 
Whatever. We got this. That, that sounds like a branch, though. Oh, what? It, I know, right? Like it sounds like a branch. It sounds almost like a branch would have had more snapping to it, though. I guess, yeah. Okay. That's I knew it. Alarm. The bell killer. Why would he go to all this trouble to kill you this way? Cause he's bored? <laughs> it's okay. You can come out of the water now. It's okay, come on. I'm on your side. He's behind me? Are you pointing at something or are you just trying to reach out to me? I think she needs to know. <laughs> I mean, yeah, probably. But she's still got the one finger pointed. Whatever. I don't know about any contract. Please, just stop. The hell is this? Her memories? Contract. What, what, what did he mean by contract? If you didn't no. let go of her hand. This is the memory of your murder. You're too young. You shouldn't see this. She's already seen it. Nice guy, Ronan. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking grab my arm, dick! <laughs> 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 I'm trying to help you here. <laughs> so yeah, that's probably why I wouldn't let me go through there, because I still got to do this shit first. Hmm. I don't care about web storage right now, Asus. Contract. Thank you. Please, just stop. Why are you doing this to me? Who are you? What are you doing? You're ill. Oh, no. I don't want to. It's simple. You like a witch hunter? He drew on you. His symbol. It must have meant something. Why do I have this feeling that's just gonna attract demons and they're gonna fucking. Oh boy. <laughs> Lots of ghosts in the graveyard right now. That's that. I should get back to joy. That was slightly helpful, I guess. Mm. I mean, we already knew he operated with the symbol, so, <laughs> like, yeah. that's only his modus operandi. I think I said that right. I have no idea. I've never heard that phrase. <laughs> his M.O. You would, oh, you, would okay. you would know it as M.O. I'm pretty sure it's modus operandi. It's like Latin or some shit. I can teleport across gaps. Yay. Because I, I can't go in water, apparently. Because I'm a ghost or something. Like, mm -hmm. water. Vampire rules. <laughs> but no, then I wouldn't even be able to pass over it. Mm. I don't know, man. Just, just cuz. Mm. There's a leaf in my way. There we go. I need two more. We're so close. So close. So close. Alright. Excuse me while I um, loudly crunch on a chip. Okay. <laughs> I, th I thought I had stepped on a branch or something like that. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck was that? <laughs> Somebody following me? Ooh, what are you? Smoking Ronin! <laughs> Those cancer sticks are going to drive Ronin, the barbarian, to an early grave. I know it's something he enjoys, but I had to confront him today. I said, if you care about living into old age with me, he'll give up these damned things. He said he'd given up plenty for me, and that it should be enough. Not exactly the most sensitive reply, but... Ronan the Barbarian is Ronan the Barbarian. And I think he never imagined he would grow to old age. Not with the life that he lives. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, she was right. Yeah, she was. I mean, also, she died before me, so. 
Not true. I guess I need to teleport. I can't go up that way. Though there might be uh, secrets up that way, but no, there's not. Come on, where is a spot I can fucking... <laughs> really? Really, game? There we go. Wow, that is very picky. <laughs> I don't know why. I can kind of go through the tree. <laughs> I am I am one with nature. <laughs> I am the... Oh. I am the spirit of the trees. <laughs> like the ants. I wish you could possess, like, normally inanimate objects and just, like, do shit with them. That would uh, be so cool. Like, I know you can kind of do it with the TV and stuff, but, like, I wish you could just, like, possess, like, other living things, like trees and shit, and just, mm -hmm. like... <laughs> the ants are going to war. If that's not a boss battle in this game now, I'm gonna be <laughs> severely disappointed. <laughs> like, I want that to happen. We'll just have to make Come our own ghost game. I heard screams and... It's good that you're okay. Well, I'm still dead. You <laughs> found something. Yeah, I did. Bell killer drowned the girl in the lake and let her body float down river. My mother was right. This is a bell killer case. Did you find anything about my mom? Memory residue or something? Sorry, kid. Memory residue. And it's a good thing you didn't see what he did to the girl. This guy is... Dog residue. Statistic. <laughs> One weird thing is that he confronted the girl about a contract before he offed her. Contract. Totally misread that as offered her. <laughs> like, offered her what? <laughs> Finish your sentence, man. Contract. No, offered her right. two what? Another case, yeah. possible <laughs> bell killer survivor. Yeah. Iris Campbell. Diagnosed with paranoid schizophrenia, incoherent ramblings about persecution, and a contract. Again. And where does it say where she is? It's a contract with Satan. It says Lux Eterna. Please. No. Yeah. Me too. Lux Eterna is a mental hospital. <laughs> it's also a great piece by Morton Lordson. <laughs> okay, ready to go? Uh, actually, um, Go on ahead. I, uh, I need to visit someone here. Oh. So I'll meet you at the hospital. Worst nightmare than this. <laughs> <laughs> I've been spotted, Snake. No. <laughs> uh. So we'll be together. Be together soon. Why did you repeat "be together"? Be together. <laughs> Oh shit, it's him! Ah. Uh, Alright. Our brother on the force. Mm. I think it was. Not, not her really. Brother. What's up? I think he was her brother. Well, yeah, that's why I said brother on the force, because he's not uh. technically related to us, like I originally uh. thought he might be. But it's like a, our brother-in-law. Our brotherly bond. Sorry, Julia. Oh, yeah. I got some bad news. Don't worry, bro. She already knows. <laughs> Poor guy. That was actually super sad. <laughs> yeah. I mean, even even the whole thing with the girl like got like super dark. Yeah, I mean, this is like a serial killer case, but still. <laughs> yeah, who would have thought? <laughs> you know, <laughs> serial cases, serial killers. Uh, that subject matter would be dark. Oh, did you know that um, in Vancouver, for about I think it was like five years, uh, there was a serial killer that would uh, take women off the streets that were like didn't have family or like wouldn't oh. really be missed and then dismembered them and fed them to his pigs. Awesome. It's like uh what's his face? Mason Verger from Hannibal <laughs> kind of He was convicted of twelve murders, but it's suspected that he had like over fifty. Over fifty. That is prolific as shit. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Jesus. 
Alright. I also love the um, Wikipedia list of serial murderers that asks that you don't increase the list by becoming a serial murderer. <laughs> uh, it's so fucked up, but yeah, it's awesome. <laughs> I feel like it's like having like a sign that says please flush in a bathroom like you should know that already Yeah, that should be pretty common sense <laughs> I would think but then again, you know some people man some people That's true. I need to Get this last one. This should be where the last one is. Yay. I did it. I'm Ooh. problem solved <gasps> All right the heirloom here we go it's a uh, mysterious vestige artifact time. I've always been a kleptomania. Klepto. It's not that I was lazy or anything. I was just bored. Storm bids sucks, were right? always more interesting mm -hmm. to me. I could just look at whatever it was and relive the exciting memory of the theft itself. Sometimes I was worried that I'd get caught. Other times I was riding an adrenaline rush. But it wasn't until the last thing I ever stole that I truly felt afraid. Was it cursed? I remember it like it was yesterday. With us. Despite <laughs> the two of us are just possessing the artifact. <laughs> <laughs> well, shut up about like my friends and I snuck into a Taco graveyard. Bell. <laughs> like 800 years in the future, we, we still won't shut up. We headed for our usual spot in old run-down mausoleum. Only this time it was locked. It seemed someone had finally taken an interest in the dead guy it belonged to and didn't appreciate us partying there. So we split up and- You've been partying and like by a dead guy's corpse the whole time? <laughs> This is turning into a weekend at Bernie's. <laughs> One of its walls had begun to crumble away, but I squeezed through. And the inside looked the same as all the others. Except for one thing. Dun, dun, dun. Lying there on top of the central tomb was a dusty frame that contained a wreath made of elaborately braided rope. Knowing that antiques were valuable, I took it. You stole some Boy Scouts, like, not badge. Not tying badge uh, so project home, that he was I hid like, hiding the there. Yes. Sleep. That night, I had horrible nightmares of a dead faced hat with rotting flesh. Delicious. No matter how many times I woke up, that's what the neutral loop is made out of. Her way back into <laughs> Over the next few days, the oh god, <laughs> and I'd wake it'd be like a Halloween item special to <laughs> clumps of my no, hair dead and, flesh. and my scalp bleeding. I chalked it up to stress and feelings of guilt about stealing from the graveyard. So the next day I went to a pawn shop to sell the wreath and be done with it. It's like a goosebumps story. I could story. feel a shiver run down my <laughs> spine when the pawnbroker informed me that the wreath wasn't made from rope at all. From hair. It was actually made from the human hair of a deceased loved one, as was customary in the late 1800s. And then the twist is that her hair is going to be, like, entwined with it now. That she'd been missing. Unfortunately, Why is she just missing hair? It didn't work. Because she was, like, pulling it out or some shit. Now, okay. I spend my time trying to track it down. Hoping to return it so I can finally... Get some sleep. <laughs> Interesting. Hmm. All right, so that poor lady is going to be haunted forever. Yeah. She should have burned the hair. Though actually, that probably wouldn't have solved anything. That probably would have just made it worse. I mean, it might have solved it. You have to like, purify it first, though. Like, salty fire. 
Salty fire. Uh, why can I not teleport over there? Oh my god, game, why? Why are you doing this to me, game? Why? There we go. Alright, I don't think we really have anything left to do here. We solved the mystery in this area. We gotta go find the asylum. Okay. I wonder if they serve M M and M to the hip when they stop talking now. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Good. You are right there. <laughs> I I woke up at six twenty this morning, which is actually sleeping in for me because I usually wake up at five. Mm. And um, the thing with my sleeping lately has been that in like the past like two months I've had like three nights of an uninterrupted sleep. So I'm like running on negative fifty three percent. It's fun. That does sound like a great time. <laughs> I overslept today way too much. I hate you. Uh, I kind of hate myself. <laughs> <laughs> like I feel like I just wasted the whole fucking day. I had so many plans, and then I was like, you know what? I would be a lazy asshole today. <laughs> and just went back to sleep. I <clears throat> I wanted to do that, but I had to like teach watching. that language. <laughs> so I had to be productive. Yeah, I just didn't have anything that I needed to be productive enough about to not feel apathetic about it at the <laughs> moment. Especially because this is like my little week of vacation I'm giving myself. That's true. So I'm just like, you know what? I will do it later. <laughs> oh hey, I found a person. I think Maybe two we people. might have already did this one. Ooh. Yeah, we did. That's oh, annoying. Do Sorry. Do you know what productive thing you should do? You should edit these videos. Yeah, that would probably be good. <laughs> <laughs> Why can't I walk through the wall, man? I already talked to them. Yeah, I know, I need to get back on editing, but like I said, I haven't even been home. Yeah. Recently. I've been out, like, partying it up and <laughs> stuff and things. <clears throat> Visiting people that I haven't seen in a while. Yeah. Basically. I know, I know what you've been up to. We've been talking. That is true. Like, last three weeks, just daily conversations. <laughs> <laughs> I know what's going on, man. Yeah, because that, yeah, that's the thing that people do. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Kitty. Next I favorite. think we've already been here, but can I get past here with the cat? Like this. No? It won't let me? Oh. Huh? Will it? I go, stop, cat. <laughs> Jump! Ah! Oh. Ah! Oh. Oh. <laughs> so close. There's gotta be a way. I wanna do it. <laughs> I wish we could do the entire thing as a cat. That would be awesome. <laughs> mm. All right. So there's no reason to go up there. We already went up there. Yeah. All right. Like, whoa. <laughs> All right. All right. I need to find a way around the ghostly wall somehow. I'm not really sure how. A ghostly ladder? Ooh, what is this? This is new. This is a fucking. Oh my god. Oh, oh hey. Okay. Party time. Yeah, let's. Uh... How did I not notice that before? <laughs> Was it there before? I th I don't know, actually. I think I remember like seeing the wheelbarrow thing, but not... The wheelbarrow was there, but yeah, the I don't think this thing was here. Can I climb on it? Can I interact with There's it? There's a small ladder. There is, but it won't let me do anything. <sighs> Darn. I know, man. I wanted to, like... Build a swing set. <laughs> <laughs> and People then... were doing a slightly different type of swing in there. <laughs> yeah. Just saying. 
What? Can I not? Did my game glitch out again? <laughs> like, I'm kind of... <laughs> I'm kind of scared that my game glitched out again and I'm just wandering around aimlessly because I can't get through, like, certain things. Like, that should have... Unless I have to do something like I did with the gate to make it... Because I should be able to just remove it like that. Yeah. I don't think that was there either earlier, actually. What? Uh, that... That place that we just came from that we yeah, can't get through. Oh, that? <clears throat> I don't yeah. know. I know, I know the, um, the other door that I removed was. Yeah. But... The one that wouldn't let me remove it? I don't think that was there. Hmm. Unless I'm just forgetting about it. Which is possible, it's like, been a while. I thought it was like a dead cow for a second. I'm like, that's an ugly cow. <laughs> what is this and why will it not let me interact with it? I'm telling you, man, I kind of feel like my game glitched out a little bit. Ooh, I can transport into here and have it be completely pointless. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> so glad. That I found that. <laughs> it's the little things yeah, in the man. afterlife. <laughs> Impromptu dance party. Can I the, get uh, it from this side? No, I can't. light. Can't go through there either. Darn. I don't know why it won't let me interact with some of this stuff. It's really weird. Get it. Is this the area with the uh, lady and her dead baby? Um, I think the other direction. Yeah. No, it was here. No. See? Yeah. Creepy dead baby. There we go. Yay! I'm actually starting to get a little bit of a lay of the land. All right, so I, I just went in a gigantic circle. <laughs> I take that back. Nice. All right, it's got to be over this way. No. <clears throat> we are definitely getting closer to the place. Yeah. Uh, I just need to go this way, I guess. No, because this is... That's the way we came from. Damn it. <laughs> I I'm, I swear to God, if my game glitched out and there's just that wall that's not supposed to be there. That'd have to be really, really funny. Like, it'd be awful, but it'd be really funny. Like, because this is the way it's telling me to go. Mm. And then when I go over there, I can't go that way. Let's do this. Eight times charm. We got this. Because then you go this way. I feel like I'm being stupid. <laughs> I feel like I... Yeah. I feel like <laughs> no. I was just being stupid. No, 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 no. Oh, hey. I have a ghostly <laughs> brother now. Hey, buddy. Cool. He likes to wiggle. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, I gotta like. There's gotta be a reason to come up here, right? Oh, that's a reason. Stop. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Yay! I need one more! Oh my god, I'm so close! Alright. We are one step closer. Yeah. Alright, there's gotta be... Maybe if I get on here... No, that song stuck in my head, man. <laughs> You're welcome. It was like, it's the, uh, the screamo part, and I can't do <coughs> screamo. But, uh... Oh, ah, ah, ah. That's a different band. <laughs> That's a completely different band. Completely different band. <laughs> it's, uh... Disturbed Park, you know. Like... <laughs> Disturbed Park. It's a very disturbed park indeed. Too many ghosts. <laughs> Just poop. Alright. I think I've been here before as well. Like back 
in yeah. the day. This is a staring situation. <laughs> uh, oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> this is good. Yeah, applaud. <laughs> applaud. Oh hey! A bell killer sign symbol hmm. thing. That. Um. He killed um, the <laughs> <laughs> Awesome. I like it. I'm just, uh. <laughs> Just gonna stand here for or float here actually. I'm just taking a, a quick rest break from gravity. All right. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I'll I'll go with it. <laughs> There's a place to hide over here. That I don't think I need. I'm just gonna go this way. Oh, this game. Yes, may I take your order, please? Drive through. I'd like an order of death. Coming right up. Taco Bell killer style. I really want Taco Bell, even though it's gonna fucking destroy me from the inside out. Yeah. Dude, I had M&Ms and they're destroying me from the inside out. That's how weak I am. My weak sauce stomach game. Mental <laughs> hospitals. Found the mental hospital. One <laughs> place torture is considered for your own good. If their experiments ever succeed in restoring a person's sanity, they better hope it was at the expense of the person's memory. Yeah, some mental hospitals can be pretty fucked up. Especially mm -hmm. like the old school ones. Oh yeah, definitely. Relax, we're out of the graveyard. And into crazy town? A big improvement. <laughs> Just don't get caught, you'll be fine. You see things <laughs> nobody else can see, end up living here. Not that crazy, come on. <sighs> okay, I'll help you get inside, but... But what? Look, if we're gonna ask this girl Iris about this contract, the asking needs to be done by a living person, right? Not if there's a special type of crazy that can actually see you. That's true. <clears throat> Just remember who opens the door for you, tough guy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'd open it if I could. Oh boy. Alright, kid. You're up. I just find a way to get Iris' room number. Um, hi. I need your help. I'm looking for a friend. Visiting hours are over. Right. But, but, she was with the cops. Then go talk to the cops. Wow, what a bitch. So I, I yeah. did, and, and they said that she was a danger to herself, and I can't help you. All right. Just need to stall her, okay? We have to figure out what her weaknesses are. Possess her. On her desk will help us. <laughs> oh wow! We're gonna, really? We're gonna have to manipulate her weaknesses like her freaking kid, like. Uh, T Rex. Like T Rex is our everyone's weakness. Obviously. Because we're just a lot weaker. Visitation severely limited. It's very strict and definitely favors family and doctors. All right, so we gotta pretend that we are family. Get well gift, but for who? Shut up, thunder. <laughs> Don't try to interrupt me. Or steal my <laughs> thunder, if you will. Ha <laughs> 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 uh, Yeah. Anyways. <laughs> I'm betting that T-Rex is for her kid. <clears throat> uh, um, young boy. <laughs> an ung boy on crutches. <laughs> ung boy. The ung boy on crutches. <laughs> this receptionist must be close to him. It's probably her kid. Or, or something. Yeah. Hey, he's there. <laughs> they said I was supposed I, to be the library. I can't say I'm inspired by this. What? <laughs> You've no. always been inspired by cats dangling from ropes. <laughs> no, maybe if the cat was like firing lasers from its eyes or something. That would be a kind of precarious. He's position. most likely a man of imposing size and stature. Someone who's accustomed to. I found to memory residue. Heinous acts in his past defy him to the point where he no longer knows 
who he truly is. So the killer is a very delusional person. Oh hey, I believe you have my stapler. <laughs> All right, so let's. Linda, I want it back. <laughs> What would make the receptionist talk <laughs> good? <laughs> the cat, obviously. <laughs> the cat. Uh, I want to say visiting hours schedule. The thing about the family. Mm. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Or not. Just joking. Okay, boy. Small child. <sighs> this game, man. I mean, like... Sometimes it's like super obvious, sometimes it's like, wait, no. Sometimes the logic is just like, yeah, no, fuck you. being here and wondering if you're okay. You're all I have left. Just like this girl's friend is all she has left. Sorry. I know how hard it can be when someone depends on you. What's your friend's name? Iris, uh, Iris Campbell. Yes. It looks like your friend Iris is here. Everything's gonna be okay. Thanks. You've got creepy I, teeth, I lady. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I got this. Just need to get my eyes on her computer screen. Okay, let's peek at it. Irish Campbell. I don't. <laughs> I don't know why. It's pronounced it Irish. Irish. She's going for electroshock therapy. Mm. You scare wolf for tonight. Orderly's en route. Oh no. <laughs> Whoa. Sorry, Wait, let me how that says in caps. She's stable. En route. <laughs> uh, they're on their way right now. <laughs> Paranoid schizophrenia, delusions, hallucination. She's room two sixteen, that's what I need. She's in room 216. Hooray. We gotta find it quick, Joy. She's scheduled for electroshock. They're on their way right now! <laughs> Alright. I don't know I why they would put that in the computer like Coast that. Is clear. I know. Right. That's why it's like a file. That's more like a status update. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, that's. Yeah, because that's your background information file. <laughs> like. <laughs> Story of her life is orderlies chasing after her. <laughs> They're always just en route to her, but they still haven't gotten there yet. It's been at least 15 years. <laughs> no, no one has been able to solve the mystery of the bell killer in Salem, not even the mystery of the symbol itself. Since there seems to be no bell at the scene of each crime, could it be that the killer is leaving an autograph of sorts? A statement of identity? If it has to do with his origins, the co logical conclusion would be that the killer originally hails from Philadelphia, another city rich in history, and home of the most famous bell in America. But are police willing to consider this bold approach if it means solving the case and saving dozens of lives? I think at this it, point... It reminds me of the opening to Powerpuff Girls. <laughs> Uh, and the, the the boss in this game is a Mojo Jojo. Obviously, that's. I mean, that's totally where. It, which Powerpuff Girl are we then? Um. Uh, right, so we're Buttercup. Yeah, I and think. And then I think, I think Joy's Blossom, and uh, Patricia or whoever the uh, receptionist Patricia. is is Bubbles. <laughs> Patricia. <laughs> Or Megan, take your pick. Patricia! Patricia! Following a strident editorial uh, yeah, on these pages that question the ability of the Salem Police Department to completely investigate the Bill Killer case, lead investigator Lieutenant Javier Crux Reyes. Javier Rex Reyes announced that six additional <laughs> officers are being assigned exclusively to the case. While unavailable for direct comment, Reyes was quoted in recent SPD press releases saying, In a department of this size, this represents an enormously significant shift of resources, which should reassure citizens of the gravity of this case, and are resolved to bring it to a conclusion. Okay. Q. Oh yeah. What are you? What the fuck are you? Oh, straight jacket. <laughs> I was like, what is that? 
<laughs> it's like the flying spaghetti monster. Um, <laughs> I need nine more. Wait, right. what? <laughs> flying spaghetti monster. Camera, up ahead. No? Okay. Nothing? Maybe? Is that something that happened in this game? <laughs> no, it's... It's okay. unrelated. Okay. I was about to be quite alarmed that I missed, missed a very significant portion of this experience. Yeah, I I wouldn't blame you. All right, let's see. Uh, Google it. Okay. It's a lot to explain. Okay. Bread, snacks, crackers, snacks, raisins, soup, and snackers, cracks. Where's a bag of soup? <laughs> yeah, bag of soup. Bag of soup. It's like you got a chicken thing on it. <laughs> No spaghetti in here, though. No. Uh -huh. They're racist waxed. against the spaghetti monsters. The one on all the way on the left just looked like wax. Wax. Okay. Hi. <laughs> that was a very delayed response. <laughs> mm. Ronan the barbarian was so good to come along. I know it's been hard for him dealing with my mood swings. I think there's something serious going on in my head, and I know he suffers the consequences along with me, but to be so supportive, to be my rock, that takes a real man. I will get through this. I will make this all with the struggle. <laughs> yep, you we'll just laugh at us. continue giggling. I can this. possess this to get her through. Mm. Another straight jacket. <clears throat> I'm assuming I gotta possess it to get her through. I like how it I can see this one through the wall. Yeah. Ding. <laughs> As like all of a sudden a bunch of patients just come running out. It's <laughs> <laughs> just like, we're free! The day is the day. Oh, hey, oh there's a person. What's it's her? her? Found her. Iris. Which is a fitting name because she never fucking blinks. <laughs> the bugs crawling up the wall. I can't get anyone to spray them. And not gonna try to squash them again. All the blind people put the restraints on me. <laughs> can't believe they put them on me. Just because they can't see the bugs? But, um... There's no bugs. <laughs> I'm a ghost and I don't even see the bugs. It's, it, it's you. You're the bug. Because you're bugging me. Ha ha ha. Uh huh. Uh huh. <laughs> anyway. Her... Twitching and not blinking is bugging me. <laughs> and she Maybe she's like a goldfish at heart. <clears throat> That's what just where you like her heart is just like a, a heart shaped bowl and then just goldfish swimming around it. <laughs> that seems highly uh, scientifically sound. I that, like it. That, that is definitely the way that, you know, anatomy works. <laughs> I mean, I for one have Boston. a beta fish for a heart. <laughs> It works. It's very violent. <laughs> <laughs> right. oh, man. Maybe that's not Iris. Maybe I just got excited for no reason. Electroshock. Cheese steak. But it didn't. <laughs> what about cheese steaks? <laughs> the first thing, like, the thing you hit, like the button you hit to make it say electroshock, I thought it said <laughs> cheese steak. <laughs> I'm like, that is not any sort of like dessert item. <laughs> What? Cheese steaks aren't even dessert. <laughs> well, I, mean, I guess they are. I guess. Uh, cheese steaks or cheesecakes? <laughs> oh, wait, I don't know. Because <laughs> the cheese steak is not a dessert item. <laughs> is that, does that exist? A cheese steak? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. That was the only 
a thing of, like a wheel of cheese <laughs> on a grill. <laughs> oh, that does not sound appetizing, but I understand now. Oh wow! I'm good. Oh, We're good. Oh man, that was oh, awesome. <laughs> I'm smart. <laughs> Do cheese steaks even exist? That's what this tabloid will try to answer. <laughs>